Shalom, brothers and sisters. WEF CEO says she runs Twitter, X, not Elon, and she introduces censorious labeling that she calls lawful but awful users. Jacarino boasted that X now has freedom of speech, not freedom of reach. This policy labels users for posting unapproved narratives, then demonize, demonetizes them, and limits their exposure. Asked about the company's so-called hate speech policies, Jacarino said it goes back to my point about our success with freedom of speech, not reach. If it is lawful but awful, it will be extraordinarily difficult for you to see it. Jacarino also hired fellow ex-NBC executive and drag queen enthusiast Joe Benaroch, who was involved in censoring anti-illegal immigration adverts by Donald Trump at the network. They are going to come and assist her at X. So if you thought, you know, oh, wow, Elon, freedom of speech, everybody gets a fair shake. No, 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 no. WEF in charge of that. And she's running that show. So it's all just a farce. And this will just be more of the same. And how quickly do you think Christian narratives and Christian truth is going to become lawful but awful and hard to find or see? very very quickly all of this is part of the plan people just need to realize it a little bit quicker on the uptake god bless keep looking up shalom